hello all welcome back to my channel today I am making a string card which is titled sunrise I had a shelf lying with me that was 24 inches long and 12 inches wide I painted it black and for the first time I put a simple frame around a string art after framing it the inner length of the board was 23.5 inches and the inner width of the board was 11.5 inches I put in 60 nails at the gap of 1 cm each along one length of the board and 25 nails along the width on both sides of the board or you can say 58 nails on the top of the board and 26 nails on each side because top corner nails are going to be common for the length and width of the board. For the semicircle, I divided the length by 4 which gave me 23.5 inches by 4 is 5.6 inches which is the diameter of the semicircle. I put in 23 nails at 1 cm apart in the semicircle. I have already used a template to make marks on the board which you cannot see but I will now use a Dremel to make small holes in the board that will help me get the nails go in easily. I prefer making marks on the board rather than using paper template as guide to put in nails because the cleanup after that is very tedious and time consuming. Once I am done drilling tiny hole marks in the board, I will start putting in nails. Getting started with the stringing, we will make one nail our anchor in the semicircle to which the thread will return after looping around nails on the edges. We will take our thread from outer edge, bring it to the anchor, take it to the second nail on the edge, bring it back to the anchor take it to the third nail and so on and so forth. We will repeat this pattern seven times and then we will skip one nail on the outer edge and one nail in the semicircle and repeat the pattern. In all we will have 14 groups of threads shooting from the semicircle to the edges. For the top edge we will continue following the same pattern but for group 5th to 10th we will not skip any nail in the semicircle but skip the nails only on the top edge. For the rest of the group we will continue to skip a nail in the semicircle again. With 25 nails on both edges and 60 on top, I have total of 110 nails. This means that the pattern in the end is short of one nail and the last group will have thread looping around 6 nails instead of 7. If you want, you can put in 26 nails instead of 25 on one side to get perfect number. This pattern is not something that will get messed up with lack of one nail, so I am not too bothered by it.
For filling the semicircle, I have simply looped the thread horizontally a couple of times and voila, we have our beautiful sunrise string art done. How did you like the string art? Do let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching this video. Check out more string art videos on my channel. Till next time, goodbye, ciao, namaste.